When we do the squeeze test, what we're looking for is soil porosity. We're looking for the amount of air and air exchange in between the pores. If we're holding structure really well, clay content is very high in that soil, or organic material content is very high in that soil, meaning our soil porosity is very, very tiny, but very heavily frequent throughout the entire soil. Therefore, we get more capillary action, we get more moisture retention. We want to try to avoid that. We want bigger air spaces so there's less capillary action and that soil profile is completely reliant on gravity and therefore when we water from the top it goes all the way to the bottom and back out the other end. Why do we want that when we have succulents? Well, we have a lot of horizontal roots. Those horizontal roots are completely engineered to act almost like an umbrella so that when the rainfall hits the roots, it's quickly absorbed. Those roots will never penetrate deep below the surface. You will never find a tap root on most succulents. The reason being is they don't want to dig for the water. They just want to catch whatever's passing through. Therefore, if we saturate those roots or we trap those roots underground, under high humidity we get something called root rot so we need to design a soil that allows the water to pass through like rain these roots are specifically engineered it is a phenotype that is designed into the succulent plant that the roots act like this this is very important to remember they don't want to change their rooting habits and we don't want them to either we want to work with them so since they're designed to catch water on the run we want to provide them that water on the run